All right, God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Welcome to the prayer service live. We're going to be starting in a bit. All right. Glory to God. All right, glory to God, glory to God. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the prayer service light. All right, we're going to begin. We're going to begin praying. Thank you, Lord. Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Lord will bless you. Lord will bless you. Lord will bless you. Lord will bless you. Greetings and welcome to our prayer service live. I just welcome every one of you that has tuned in to this uh, broadcast. We're supposed to have this service um, a couple of hours ago, um, but I just got back from an, you know, an invite, and I was ministering somewhere, and then I said, "No, it doesn't matter. Though we are late, let's still have the the prayer." Uh, service all right so we're going to be praying all right we're going to be praying tonight for some of you watching it's afternoon all right we're going to be praying this afternoon all right um for some of you it's lunch time so we caught you at the right time to pray all right so as we pray god is going to be doing great and mighty things in our midst i want us to understand that our prayers are not in vain right our prayers are not in vain each time we pray something happens all right each time we pray something does what something happens all right and 
something will happen tonight. Something will happen today. Something will happen as we pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Just click on the share button, all right? Let's get as many people tuned in as possible. Let's get as many people tuned in, all right? Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Parado do shateriandi ali brahashti. Rikado shagadagada. Click on the share button. All right, let's get as many people tuned in as possible. La karada boho shariandi ali ushti. Rakatali ali ushti. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you for such a time, such an ambience in your presence. All right. Father, we thank you in the name of Jesus. Librado ustaladi fragaba shalia disni anda habrio lo fredish dia libra gadaliaste. We thank you for this opportunity, for this time that we have to be in your presence. Lord, we give you all praise, all glory. We ask that you take charge in the name of Jesus. There is a scripture the Bible says men ought always to pray and not to think. Men ought always to pray and not to faint. All right? So even the scripture tells us, First Thessalonians, the Bible says in chapter 5, all right? First Thessalonians 5. When you begin to read from verse, you know, from verse um, 16, 17, 18, 19, the Bible says, pray without season. All right? Pray without season. It means always. We live in such a world that the devil is working 24-7, all right? The devil is always at work. The Bible says he uh, is like a roaring uh, a lion seeking whom he may destroy, all right? He's seeking whom he may destroy. So the devil is out there, you know, constantly seeking, constantly um um, you know, looking for somebody to fall prey to him. But I decree and I declare in the name of Jesus, you will not fall prey to the enemy in the name of Jesus. Come on, child of God, you will not fall prey to the enemy in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree that you are stirred up in your spirit, sensitive in the spirit, activated in the realm of the spirit, that you will not be victimized. In the mighty name of Jesus. There is a scripture the Lord is just dropping in my spirit. Let me just uh, turn my Bibles quickly. If you have a Bible, turn quickly. Turn quickly to the scripture. Uh, let's turn to First John. Quickly, let's turn to First John. 1 John. First John chapter 5. If you have a Bible, turn there quickly. First John 5. My God. 
Labrodosh de la Difra Hadias de la Difra Casulia Tajde. All right, first John chapter five. Let's read verse four. First John chapter five. First John five. Let's read together verse four. Here's what the scripture says. He says, For whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. Let's read again. It says, For whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. And this is the victory that overcometh the world, even our faith. All right, let's read it one more time. First John 5 verse 4 says, For whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. And this is the victory that overcometh the world, even our faith. So it says, whatever is born of God. I love the fact that it doesn't say whosoever is born of God. It says whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. So I preached this before and I gave this understanding that you as a child of God, you are a person, all right? So when you receive the Lord, when you receive him in your heart as your Lord and personal Savior, you are born again. But now I want you to understand that you fall under whosoever. So when the Bible goes further to say whatsoever, it means it is not just a person. All right? So when you are a born again child of God, anything that belongs to you, that same victory that you have extends to that thing. Come on, I wish I, wish I was preaching uh, today. I wish you get in this tonight. Right? When you are born again, when you are born again, Anything that you possess also has the same victory or also should have the same victory that you have. Are you getting this as a child of God? So what does that mean? It means as a child of God that is born again, your car also has this victory. So your car has such victory that overcomes the world that when the enemy has come against your vehicle, you have victory. So what, that, what does that mean? It means that you don't get involved in accidents. And if it happens that you find yourself in an accident, you don't get hurt. And your car does not become a write-off because it also possesses that same victory. <laughs> your house has victory. All right? When there are natural disasters and so on and so forth, they don't come near your house. Psalm 91 applies. He that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord is my refuge, my fortress, my God. In Him do I trust. All right? The Bible says, A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand. It will not come near you. You are not just covered, but your household is covered. Are you getting this? This is the victory that we have in Christ. So when you are a child of God and you have things, you don't have to buy, you don't have to change them because they are damaged. You have to change them because you want something better. I wish you getting this, all right? So when you're using a phone, you don't have to change your phone because it's, it's, it's stolen. No, you change your phone because you are ready to get a new one. Maybe there is somebody you want to give the one you have to. You sow it as a seed to somebody and you get a better one. All right? The same with your car. The same with your properties. You don't have to go through theft. You don't have to suffer theft of your items, your belongings, your properties. All right? So that victory that you have as a child of God extends to the things that you own. And the Bible says, whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world, but this is the victory that overcomes the world, our faith. So these things that I'm telling you are possible, but they don't happen unless you apply your faith. Are you getting this? Unless you do what? You apply your faith. So you got to apply your faith. You got to lay hands on your car. You got to lay hands on your house. You got to lay hands on your business, on your properties. And decree in the name of Jesus, I extend victory. All right? I extend victory victory in the name of Jesus to you my business you will not go under no matter how bad the economy is my business you will keep on increasing in the name of Jesus 
By faith, you extend that victory. And it happens. You lay hands on your body. Lay hands on your legs, on your eyes, on your head, on your ears. Everything that belongs to you. Lay hands on it and decree victory by faith. And you will have it. You are more than a conqueror. And everything about you should be exactly the same. Are you getting this? So I'm giving us this insight before we start to pray. Because as we pray, I want us to understand this. That our prayer is going to work over everything. It's going to work over your body. It's going to work over your marriage, your business. Ah, We can even pray. And that device that is not working in your house will start to work now. Are you getting this? Are you getting this? It will start to work. So we're going to pray. Get ready. Get ready. This is the victory that overcometh the world. Even our faith. So we're going to start to pray. And I'm just going to begin to check those of you that have dropped your prayer request. And we're going to pray for you. And something will happen. All right, we're going to start with Deb Longo. We're going to start with Deb Longo. Um, Deb Longo. All right. We're going to start with you. I see something here. Libro do Shatel India. Sniabla Hostel de Fragabasha. All right, Deb Longo says, uh, says, pray for me. It says, pray for me. I have emergency in doctor's office now as I have blood pressure suddenly. And I'm a runner, been a runner 25 years. Been a runner 25 years. Now, this shows you, for someone who's been a runner, this shows you that this is not normal. There is something wrong that has come with this blood pressure. But listen, listen, Deb, hear this. I'm going to pray for you now. I'm going to pray for you now. And you're going to be free now. I'm talking about now. In the name of Jesus, you're going to be free now. All right? Your blood pressure will begin to come down now. Your chest is going to open up. I'm talking about now. You're going to receive an instant miracle. Do we have people, witnesses that believe God for an instant miracle now? All right, we're going to pray for you now. And you're going to get it now. In the name of Jesus, every one of us, let's join our faith. Let's lift up our, 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 our voices wherever you are. Just begin to pray. Join our faith. In the name of Jesus, we decree that her heart, her chest opens up. Let that blood pressure go down. Get normal now. Whatever demon, whatever powers behind it, we frustrate their efforts. In the name of Jesus, Father, we pray for Deb now. In the name of Jesus, Deb, hear this. I rebuke that foul spirit of sickness. I rebuke that foul spirit of disease. The demon, the authority behind that blood pressure, behind that sickness, that disease, in the name of Jesus, I rebuke it now. In the name of Jesus, I command your blood pressure to be normal now. In the name of Jesus, let your chest open up. Let your airwaves open up. Let your arteries open up. In the name of Jesus, let your veins be cleared. Ha, ha, ha. Let there be a free flow of air, a free flow of blood. In the name of Jesus, let your blood vessels receive a touch from God now. In the mighty name of Jesus. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Right now, 
right now you are free something is moving inside of you right now you are free that's it that's it i see your breathing opening up i see your chest opening up opening up in the name of jesus it now you you just feel just a bit of heaviness a bit of heaviness a bit of heaviness all right a bit of heaviness on your body a bit of heaviness on your body that's a manifestation of your healing that's a manifestation of your healing and right now gradually gradually your chest is opening up in the name of jesus that's your healing happening right now take it it is done it is done in the name of jesus christ in bladishtia in two hours in two hours when you check your blood pressure again it will be normal it will be normal it will be normal in the name of jesus settled case is settled somebody celebrate jesus it is done already in the name of jesus and we would like to see and hear your testimony when it happens drop your testimony here and we're going to celebrate with you it is done in jesus name it's done in jesus name done in jesus name i see a prayer request here from from vj says please pray for nadia julius and me from for healing from these spells and light headed and a high heart rate and high sugar levels and pray for complete healing for vinoda all right complete healing for vinoda <clears throat> all right we're going to pray for this family in the name of jesus for the hand of the lord to rest upon this family now from the first to the last in the name of jesus but I see the Blongo saying, I'm going to sow a seed for this anointing in a covenant agreement. The Lord bless you, Deb. The Lord bless you. Every time we sow in covenant agreement, strange things happen. So as you sow, Deb, in the name of Jesus, as you sow your seed, uh, the angels of the Lord will move in your favor. Amen. So we we'll lift our voices and we pray for Nadia. We we'll pray for VJ. We we'll pray for Julius. In the name of Jesus, every light headedness, la prado shate. Let the Lord take it away now. In the name of Jesus, la prado shagardishnia. Uh huh. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. As I'm praying for you, VJ, in the name of Jesus, as we're praying, the Lord is ministering to me to tell you. All right, that there has to be an adjustment in meals. There has to be an adjustment in meals. But what the Lord is is pinpointing on is intake of fluid, water. All right, let water become a, a part of of your daily intake. Let everyone take lots of water. All right, let every one of you drink lots of water lots of water as much water as possible i believe um between two to four liters of water every day is very essential all right so as you do this your healing will be perfected in the name of jesus tonight the hand of the lord rest on your family sleep good wake up revived in the name of jesus y'all are gonna wake up feeling brand new all right, you're gonna wake up feeling brand new, knowing that a burden has been lifted, knowing that you are made whole. It is done in the name of Jesus. Father, we lift up also Vinoda in the name of Jesus. We we'll pray for complete healing for Vinoda. Galabashataria 
Zele de brostia, li brizna, anda gardiza, la di proko friados, deli hadiastia. Complete healing for Vinoda in the name of Jesus. The Lord is ministering concerning Vinoda that I must minister to her to not, there is a scripture that says, don't forsake the gathering of the saints. So she needs to find a church where she will be going to physically. All right, the Lord is ministering to me about the physical presence. Let her find a church that she will be going to physically, all right, and fellowshipping with the saints. There is an atmosphere, there is an ambience of God's glory in the atmosphere of his presence. There is an ambience of God's glory in the atmosphere of his presence, all right? So let her find a church that she will go to physically, all right, and worship God. And every area of her life will receive perfection in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. It is done in the name of Jesus. It is done in the name of Jesus I see, uh, is this uh, super rhymes? Rhymes in Pofu. It says, I would like to pray for my relationship and for my business. I opened an Uber Eats account and I wish it to be a success and be open so that I can start making my own money. Amen. Um, C4 C rhymes in Pofu. Um, help me understand better when you say uber eats account you mean you 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 join in uber eats um as in you you're gonna be doing deliveries and things like that if that's what you mean let me know quickly in the comment session let me know in the comment session all right let me know in the uh comment session all right I have a prayer request here um, by SMS. While we're waiting for for Sipo Rhymes and Pofu, let's pray for for Stabile. For Stabile, uh, Stabile says, pray for my niece Samantha. Says, pray for my niece Samantha. Says, says she has got swollen feet since 2007. She's got swollen feet. I wish you were here, Stabile, online. I have a bit of questions for you. All right? She's got swollen feet since 2007. That's about uh, 14 years. That's about 14 years. All right? She's had swollen feet. My niece. All right? I need information like how old is this niece? of yours how old is this niece and how did this come about but then we're going to pray for her we're going to pray for samantha and god is going to heal her in the name of jesus so let's lift our voices and pray for her all right the lord is saying hold on the lord is saying hold on all right we're going to come back and pray for samantha in a bit all right we're going to come back and pray for her let the angels do their work all right, as we uh, are waiting for the Lord to give the go-ahead, we're going to pray for Google too. We're going to pray for Google too. She says, uh, pray for me to get a stable job and positive feedback from my previous interviews. All right? So as I'm reading this, sometimes as I read prayer requests, we pray the most appropriate version of the prayer. So it says, a stable job and positive feedback from my previous interview so what we're going to pray for is a, a stable job all right a good when you have a good stable job you don't need a positive feedback from interviews and positive feedback from interviews they don't guarantee a job so we're going to pray for google that she gets a good stable job a great job great environment great package and great peace with the job in the name
name of Jesus. Father, we'll lift up your daughter before you. And we'll pray for her. La brada shalida zia etu karia sunyande. Lebo shaladivrus niolimbrangando host alibrashtia. Ezagadaria saladibrashtia. Ezilianda hashti. Maliado zaladi braste li asniam blindo fracazelia zalada baba babo shate as salidi braste ledi fra gazelia and hashtia. Lord, we thank you and we believe you for it. We know it is done. Thank you, Lord, for doing it. In Jesus' mighty name of prayer. In Jesus' mighty name of prayer. It is done. Now we're going to pray for Sipo. We're going to pray for Sipo. In the name of Jesus, let his business move forward. Let his business move forward and produce great results. In the name of Jesus. All right? Produce great results. Produce great results so he can make extra income. In the name of Jesus. Father, we'll pray for your son. Liba Asate. Zelika rabasa liznia limbrondus niaste Zalika radapa babo shateria dogozo Eria shaladi proyosnia under the cras de la di fro shate Maliaca bradoza liznia asugar di shata Le borro do bosil di fraliznia under the brohostia. It is said, Lord, we thank you, it is done. In Jesus' mighty name of prayer. Amen. Settled in the name of Jesus. Settled in the name of Jesus. Brother Hashtia. All right, we're going to pray for Brian. I'm going to pray. It says a prayer for my bank funds to clear and no more delay. It says a prayer for my bank funds to clear and no more delays. Prayer for my bank funds. Oh, pray. Lift our voices. Father, we'll pray in the name of Jesus for your son. Zela Zalea Bosnia Asha Tatalaba Zeladisnia. Thank you, Spirit of the Lord. It is done in Jesus' mighty name of prayer. In Jesus' mighty name of prayer. Jesus' mighty name of prayer. We're going to pray for Jennifer Adams. We're going to pray for Jennifer Adams. Adams. We're going to pray for Jennifer Adams. I see here it says, pray for me for my debts to clear. It's a bit hectic for her debts to clear. Alright, we're going to pray for Jennifer. We're going to pray for Jennifer. And as I'm reading your prayer points, the Lord is saying to me that we're going to pray for the Lord to send you a helper. A helper. A helper. Alright. The Lord is going to send you help in the name of Jesus. Help. All right. You're going, you're going to get help. All right. And you're going to begin to see an increase in the flow of finances. Labado Shate. Jennifer, where are you watching from? Where are you watching from, Jennifer? As I'm reading in this and I'm praying for you, the Lord is saying to me, is opening my eyes and speaking to me about your life. He says, praying for the dead to clear will not solve it all right because the lord opened my eyes and began to minister to me about your life jennifer i don't know if you're still here minister to me and the lord is saying to me that this is a strong there is a strong foundational altar fighting a strong foundational altar fighting because even before you got into debt before you got into debt there's been a strong battle when it comes to finances. Strong battle when it comes to finances. That money keeps on getting missing. How do I mean? Money just doesn't... You can't really explain money. It will say you, you have to account 
for your expenses, you can't really account where your money is going, Jennifer. That's what the Lord is saying to me. You can't really account. This has been happening for a long time. And the Lord said, there is an altar that is working against you. And we have to pray for the angels of the Lord to be deployed so that this altar can be destroyed. Are you getting me, Jennifer? Are you getting me, Jennifer? So if this altar, when these altars are destroyed, your finances shall be restored. All right? Money will start to flow in and money will remain. In the name of Jesus. And that goes for everyone having money challenges. As we pray, tune in by faith because money will start to flow in and money will remain. In the mighty name of Jesus, La Casa Palajede, Riberia Zulika Dozo, Lerdi Brandi Ashtia. Lord, we deploy your angels in the name of Jesus to the life, to the family of Jennifer. Lord, in the name of Jesus, whatever altars, whatever altars, fighting her finances and the finances of everyone tuned into this broadcast in the name of Jesus. Lord, those altars are destroyed now. Those altars are destroyed now. In the name of Jesus. La de 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 ba shada. Le geridi zoliznia asubariato zagari shade. E sulibra gasha da 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 liambrondoste. In the name of Jesus, those altars are destroyed. Receive financial freedom. As money enters your hand, Money will stay in the name of Jesus. Money will grow in the name of Jesus. Money will multiply in the mighty name of Jesus. Receive fresh ideas for business exploits. Receive wisdom for multiplication of good, beneficial business and finance relationships. In the name of Jesus. The Lord is gifting you to be able to, to nurture relationships that will bring you financial abundance. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord will connect you to someone that will connect you to a breakthrough. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. It is done. It is settled. In Jesus mighty name. Amen. Amen. Celebrate. It is done. It is done. It is done. And I'm going to pray for Wendy. We're going to pray for Wendy. For Wendy. We're going to pray for Wendy. We're going to pray for Wendy. All right. Wendy says, uh, Wendy says, please pray for my family. So much is going on between them. Pray for my family. So much is going on between them. We're going to pray for Wendy for peace. For the Lord's peace. Allah the heavy hand of the Lord is coming down upon every family member and peace shall be birthed in that family now in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray for Wendy and her family. Thank you, Lord. Wendy, your family is settled. In the name of Jesus, you will use your mouth to give testimony of what the Lord has done in Jesus. In mighty name we pray. In Jesus. Mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Name we pray. It is settled. Stabile has not joined the service yet. So let's pray for her. Uh, did she say her niece? Samantha. All right. Let's pray for uh, her niece that has had swollen feet. Stabile, if you 
are tuned in or if there's someone connected to her, tell her to give me a call all right tell her to give me a call um libra do shall libra all right the lord is saying we shouldn't pray let her give me a call all right there are certain things i need to tell her for this needs of hers that has got swollen feet all right so we're going to do as the lord instructs so that this healing shall be perfected in the mighty name of jesus christ there's an ambience of god's presence it's an ambience of god's presence and i want us to know that strange things have been released all right strange things ha have been released in this meeting all right so wherever you are tuned into this broadcast wherever you're watching from strange things have happened already all right so go and celebrate go ahead and celebrate rejoice because we will hear your testimony i don't know if deblongo is still here deblongo with who we're praying for concerning the blood pressure and stuff are you still here come and give us your testimony if you're still here with us all right so everyone here something has happened i decree strange things strange results in your finances all right here's what the lord is saying to me to decree over your life that little effort with little effort you will reap a great harvest the lord is saying i must decree this over your life with little effort you will reap a great harvest in the name of jesus with little effort, you will reap a great harvest. In the name of Jesus, no more shall you suffer to reap a harvest. In the name of Jesus, progress will come with ease. I say progress will come with ease. In the name of Jesus, receive wisdom. Ha, receive wisdom. In the name of Jesus, receive wisdom to handle the gifts that God has given you. Receive the wisdom and the grace to multiply what God has given to you. In the name of Jesus, I pray for your environment. Be Let your environment be saturated with the ambience of God's glory, the manifestation of His presence, the reality of His Spirit. In Jesus' mighty name. It is done. It is settled. It is done. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord bless you. Remember to stay connected to our page. All right. If you've not liked the page, like the page, click on the follow button. And then we've started a YouTube page that we are working on and we're doing our best to grow bit by bit. So the, go on YouTube and look for our page, Mommy TV Life. All right. Click on like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and be a part of what God is doing. All right. Mommy TV Live on Facebook. I'm glad that every one of us, we are here and we're doing well. The number of testimonies we receive are just so amazing, all right? Earlier this morning, I was speaking with Joe Mtimba. I spoke with Joe Mtimba this morning, and we we're just talking about the goodness of God, all right? How God has been amazing to Joe, and that's amazing. And I spoke also, um, I think it was yesterday or a few days ago, to Renazlin, Renazlin from Haiti or Haiti, right? And she was telling me about the goodness of God. All right, she wasn't working when she started watching our broadcast, and we prayed, we declared, and now God gave her a good job. All right, so so many things are happening through our online broadcast. Make sure you are part of it. All right, make sure you are. Sharing when God is doing this thing, share. I see something here says, Please pray for our prayer and fasting later, man of God. Roxanne, are you praying and fasting? All right, um, uh, drop me an inbox, all right, so I can understand better. And then I'm gonna have a one on one prayer with you, Roxanne. All right, the Lord bless you, each and every one of you. The Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. Stay connected, and we will be seeing you. Um, next time we are live all right the lord bless you this is most all the prophet and this is mommy tv